everyone's name is Bakery and today I have to try number three and sorry if I haven't been making videos it's because um school's in the way and I had homework and all that stuff so yeah so first I made some mirror charms so this is my first time making them so yeah and I have this little orange one it's really shiny because I glazed it and it has a little leaf and stuff and here's the mirror and then I have this little jelly donut mirror so it's like jelly donut and then it's textured and all that it's like powdered with the red jelly and then here's the side and then that yeah you guys you saw my hair but yep and then lastly this little macaroon mirror i'm gonna use the mold for this so yep and now we have the miniature so i have this little bread loaf with two slices My favorite miniature is this. It has all types of bread and I glazed it and it's like really shaded and stuff. Then I have this miniature. It's a, pl a plate of donuts and this is removable. So yeah, it's really cute. It's the strawberry vanilla and chocolate. It's on a little plate. And then I have this little steak inspired by Tony Allison. There's like bones and like the stick part. And it's really textured and um, shaded. So yeah, I really like this. And then I have this little dangle one. It has two dumplings, I guess, and green tea. And two dangles. And this was inspired by someone off DeviantArt. And then I have this TV retro dinner. It has mashed potatoes, turkey, carrots and peas and this is inspired by Tony Ellison so yeah so now I have the realistic charms so I have this really small cake roll sorry I have to cover the whole thing with my hand so it can focus then I have this little s'more I really like how the crackers turned out and the marshmallow and the chocolate And then I have the strawberry cake with three strawberries on top. Icing. Strawberry filling in there. Then I have this um, tart. Strawberry tart with three strawberries. Inspired by jellyfish charms. Um, and then I have this ice cream cookie sandwich. Inspired by Tony Allison. Then I have this little cheeseburger. Everyone makes this, so I don't know who to give it credit to, but yeah. So the meat's textured and the bun's textured and all that stuff. Then I have this little Linzer cookie and inspired by Tony Ellison. Then I have this uh, hot dog. And then it has texture and all that. And then this part also has some texture. I like the meat part, yeah. And it has a little mustard on top. Then I have this Neapolitan ice cream sandwich. I have this really sick chocolate chip cookie. And lastly, for the, the realistic charms, I have this blueberry muffin and it's shaded and all that. And I really love these in real life because they're really good. So now I have some character charms. So I have this Kiratori um, macaroon inspired by Pretty Good X390. I have this Mamagoma one. Then I have this um, Mickey Mouse pancakes, stack of pancakes, and there's whipped cream and um, syrup. And this is inspired by the squishy. The, the squishy had three layers, but I only had made two layers. And then I have this um, Mickey Mouse waffle. I didn't shade this because I didn't feel like it needed. But yeah, there's syrup and butter. I really like how the butter, like the um, syrup turned out. Then I have this um, Totoro cream puff, and there's like a little leaf, and then texture and the cream puff. And this is inspired by Funky Pink Gal. And I have this um, Totoro waffle. See, so there's like a little yellow leaf, but butter so yeah and now we I have some kawaii charms so I have this little ranch Dorito inspired by pink gym girls tutorial 
I really like the vase. It's super cute. And then I have this little mango mochi cookie. The face is kind of a fail, but yeah. Then it's textured. Then I have this stamp. Yeah. I have this stamp inspired by Gucci Land. It's really small. Then I have this um, really, really small tear um, raindrop cookie. It has a little face as well. It's pretty small. Then I have this little Pop Tart, Koi Pop Tart inspired by um, Ninja23001. It has a face. It's like a strawberry one. It's really textured as well. Then I have this little pig bun, which is one of my favorite charms I made. This is inspired by Pretty Girl X390s like one of her camera dates that I saw so yeah it's really really cute and lastly this Hanari Tofu cookie inspired by Funky Pink Gal it's one of my favorite charms ever it's like a green tea one and I took it forever to make the arms and the legs because it's like really small it's textured right there so now I have some little donuts sorry sorry I moved the camera so I have this um, cherry swirl one these were all inspired by Pretty Girl X90's tutorial and I have this chocolate caramel one. And I have this cocoa banana one. Then I have this green teeny one. Then I have this blueberry one. Blueberry flower. Or like blue flower. I don't know. And lastly this chocolate fudge strips one. It's one of the easiest and the prettiest one I made. So yeah. Then I have this um we mint donuts, so this daisy duck one. This goofy one. And then this Winnie the Pooh one with the bee. Yeah, focus. So yeah, and then there's texture. Then this um piglet one. Then I have this Pluto one. It's like a little churro. It's really textured on the ears. And then these these last two are my favorites. So I have this um, Donald Duck one. One of the favorite ones I made. And then this Marie the Cat one. It's like a little curler donut, which is one of my favorites. And then the last time ever is this um, little Eat Me cookie. And inspired by um, Clay Cup as far as... Um, tutorial so yeah these are all my charms and i hope you guys like them and sorry for the long video so yeah bye guys